What does third grade writing look like? Third grade is a big year for reading and writing. This year, they're flexing their idea muscles and learning to communicate those ideas in more complex ways. You might be a little surprised by the writing they can do. Take this example of an essay on how to save water. Saving water. Saving water is important because if you don't save water, nothing would be able to live. A third grade essay starts with a simple introduction that tells why the topic matters. For example, people, animals, and plants would not be able to live and has a simple thesis statement that tells what the essay is about. There are lots of ways to save water. Third graders will include examples from their reading that are simple and straightforward and still support the topic. In this case, about ways to save water. One way to save water is to use a pitcher and fill it up with water and keep it in your refrigerator so it stays cold and you don't have to run water from the sink and waste it when it's getting cold. Another way to save water is to put a bowl under your vegetables while they are being washed and catch the water so you can use it to water your plants. And you should start to see more detail and elaboration in these examples. Another way to save water is to put a barrel outside to catch the rainwater and use it to water your vegetables. Also, another way to save water is to take short showers because if you do, it saves water. Third grade sentences are getting longer and more complex but you'll see that they're still learning to punctuate those complex thoughts. Their spelling is also getting better. Also, you can save water by taking short showers and no baths because baths waste a lot of water. It is also fun to play in the sprinkler in summer, but only do it when the lawn is being watered. And finally, the essay will have a short conclusion that restates the thesis and tells why saving water is important. There are lots of ways to save water. If you don't save water, then there will be there won't be any water in the future, so save water. So how do you know your child's writing is up to snuff? Well, by the end of the year, a third grader's writing will have an intro with a simple thesis statement, examples from the reading that clearly support the thesis, a short conclusion, and improving spelling capitalization and punctuation.